Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for Aretha Jones. All right, Aretha. Hey! Y'all give it up for Tom Joyner having his TV show on for y'all. Y'all doing all right? Where my old school people at right now? Where my old school? You're old school, a bunch of old ass people. I love it. Old ass people right here. Soul Train in his first trimester, old school. The manager. Me, shoot, I don't get today's stuff. These kids, they, you know what? They, they, what's up with glamorizing thugs? Since when is it a good? Don't thugs rob people? Uh, okay. These little girls is in love with these thugs. They attractive, girl. My, my boyfriend a thug. <laughs> girl, he knocked me in the head, stole my purse. Oh, <laughs> Grown ass man with the vocabulary of a third grader, and can't keep his pants full up over his butt. That's retarded. That's retarded. That's what a lot of these thug rappers, I don't mind them, but they, a lot of them a little too, they done got retarded now. What's wrong with that one that be hollering all the time? What? What's his name? That boy got Tourette's. What? What's his name? Baby, baby, John, Lil John, Lil John, what? I should know it's because it's retarded. That's retarded. Retarded people always hollering out their own name, huh? Legion! <laughs> Legion! <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, you! Yeah. <laughs> I bet his mama didn't. Legion, what? <laughs> Come in the house. Oh, okay! <laughs> the retarded people. What's wrong with that other one? Everybody on Usher album did retarded hell. Ludacris with his cross-eyed ass. The whole damn thing ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, he isn't. No, he love living so country because. <laughs> well, you looking at your own eye. Look at you, no wonder. <laughs> retarded folks. Oh, ugly 50 Cent is still in the business, ain't he? <laughs> I said he ugly. I don't care about his chest. His teeth hanging down his chin. I bet he could chew down a tree. I'm on a turkey to the candy shop. If you don't know what I got. You ain't got no dental insurance. That's what you ain't got. Did he tear carrot up? Well, I ain't gonna no, no, no. I'm a gopher. I'm old school. I don't care, man. I'm a grown woman. Forget y'all. I'm growing. I, I may not look at. See, I'm skinny, but you know, right now, I'm sorry. Mm, I need to take a breather. I got this Wonder Bra on. It's about to choke the hell out of me. <laughs> Let me relax. I like this thing. I got these suckers pumped up to my chin, Mama. <laughs> That's right, ladies. If you got little ones, pump them up, girl. Pump them up. Why get breast implants when you can buy you some? See, these fourteen ninety nine in Macy's. <laughs> pump them suckers up. Girl, and I'm not just trying to, I'm not making them big, guys. Let me tell y'all, I'm just trying to pick them up off my stomach. Because they're falling. I'm at that age. I feel like I'm going from 34B to 34 long. I have to compensate for something. I ain't got no booty. Butts are the most important thing on black women. I'm out of uniform. I have so been out of uniform my whole life. And I grew up in the black community where if you ain't got no butt, you ain't going to the prom. <laughs> I ain't been to prom the first, I'm serious. And now butts are popular. Ain't that something? They the, they the thing to have now. Damn Beyonce, she done took having a butt to a whole new meaning. <laughs> she done taught her butt how to dance. She like, uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. I still can't do it, girl. That's my shoulder doing that. I be done throwing my back out trying to do that dance. What's another Serena Williams? She playing tennis with all that butt. That girl must have a strong back. Because that's like dragging a 50-pound midget around on your back. Ain't it? She could use her butt as another tennis partner. She could play doubles by herself. Oh, I got it, I got it. Yeah, that's a lot. That's in, that's in, that's in. 
shoes. Jennifer Lopez, she started the mess. Jennifer Lopez got white women trying to get a butt now. That's why they got butt implants out there. They do. I looked into it. <laughs> I did. Them things are high. It's about $10,000 per cheek. And I, I can't get no butt implants. I, I certainly don't have good enough credit to finance those butt implants. <laughs> I didn't charge up some butt implants and miss the payments. <laughs> Come and repossess my ass, won't they? <laughs> I'm serious. Bill collectors be doing booty calls on me. <laughs> Look, Miss Jones, you about six months behind on your behind, ma'am. Now you gonna have to give up the booty now, ma'am. Now we're bring a truck. You just back that thing up, ma'am. Just back that thing. Y'all, I'm sorry. I just, I'm body conscious. I've been body conscious all my life because I'm a skinny black woman. You know, I'm a skinny black woman. See, I look at all these, these little stars out there. They all looking anorexic. You don't never see no black women trying to get no anorexia. We got to keep weight on us. You ever think you've seen a black anorexia? You better believe that's crack cocaine. You hear me? <laughs> Didn't nobody think Whitney had anorexia. They were like, that girl hitting a pipe. That's what she doing. <laughs> we got to keep weight on us. That's why I get, I get so mad when people make comments about my, because I've been like this all my life, and I get mad when people make them comments, you know, like this guy. I'm going to tell you some men, if y'all want to speak to a lady, just speak to her. Don't throw some offhanded comment about her body in the damn greeting. You hear? That's rude, because you don't know you could be insulting a woman. This brother hollered at me. Tell my Lord, yo, 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 what's up, Slim? <laughs> I hit him back, what's up, Toothless? <laughs> And he got mad. Girl, why you gonna be like that? I like skinny women. I like teeth. <laughs> you hit me, I'm gonna hit you back. And I'm gonna tell you something. I get, I get it all the time. I go to this, this gym. I got a little ghetto gym membership, you know. Sometimes, you know, it's, it, it does, in my gym, it's about everybody in there about two and a half tons. So, you know, they hate my, my butt. You know, they, I'm like the skinniest person on the block. Basically, and, and it's like they hate me. They treat me like I'm invading their territory. Because a lot of big women that have issues with their weight. You know, sometimes they be angry at skinny women. Like they blame us for making them fat. <laughs> like, I didn't push your chair up to the buffet table. Why are you mad at me? <laughs> you did that. So I'm trying to get my workout on. I'm serious. I got my reasons for working. I'm trying to grow a butt. I'm doing squats and lunges. You know, I'm doing, I got my reasons. How come a whole herd of these heifers had the nerve to confront me? I'm serious. I don't mean to be mean, but I'm serious. They, had to, they got that all mean. They're like, what you doing in there trying to work out with your little skinny ass? You look like you need to be at home eating a sandwich or something with your skinny ass. So they hit me, I hit them back. I said, what you doing in here? It's kind of late, ain't it? You should have been in there 300 pounds ago. <laughs> I said it! She shouldn't have messed with me! They got mad as hell, too. They won't come get, girl, we gonna kick your skinny ass. I said, look, I'm gonna run up a flight of stairs and lose you. Come on. <laughs> I'm your new workout partner. You chase me, you lose weight. Come on, let's do this. <laughs> I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm all right, y'all. I'm sorry, this hair is getting in my mouth. I'm about to take it off. Anyway, uh, I ain't the only one wearing some hair in here. Like, I am looked around the room now. We gonna put some hair on, huh, sisters? That's one thing about black women, we will put some hair on. We ain't shame about putting no hair on now. We ain't shame now. Weaves are common now, ain't it? We see a sister with a weave, we know it's a weave. She know, we know it's a weave. We know, she know, we know it's a weave. Now, they, we compliment her on the weave now. We like, girl, your hair look good. Where you buy it from? <laughs> girl, what color is that, 12B? <laughs> I heard that. But see, we in Hollywood, there's still some women out there got the head for the weave, be perpetrating the people. Still lying, telling people that's really their hair. You know that old lie, they talking about they mixed with another race, girl. Mm-hmm, this all my hair, I'm mixed with Indian and German. <laughs> Say, Heppa, you mixed with needle and thread. Why are you lying? <laughs> you mixed with bond and glue. I'm out of here. I'm Aretha Jones. Thank you very much, you guys.